opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The French defense prepares for d5, but blocks in the light squared bishop in exchange for a strong center and counter attacking chances. d4 grabs full control of the center and opens up the dark squared bishop. d5 is a counter attack in the center that threatens the e4 pawn. Nd2 develops the knight and defends the e4 pawn. Nf6 attacks the e4 pawn and supports the d5 pawn. e5 closes the center, attacks the knight on f6, and controls the d6 and f6 squares. Nfd7 retreats the attack knight and prepares the c7 c5 pawn break. Bd3 develops the bishop, controls the e4 square and attacks h7. C5 attacks the d4 pawn and prepares to develop the knight to c6 behind the c pawn. C3 defends the d4 pawn and allows the queen to develop on the queen side. And c6 develops the knight and attacks the d4 and e5 pawns. And e2 develops the knight, protects the d4 pawn and prepares castling. Cx d4 releases the tension in the center and attacks the pawn on c3. Cx d4 recaptures the pawn and opens up the c3 square. F6 attacks the e5 pawn, but slightly weakens black's king side. X6 captures the f6 pawn and opens up the center. Nx f6 captures the pawn, recentralizes the knight and unblocks the light squared bishop. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Bd6 develops the bishop to an active square where it controls the center and attacks the h2 pawn. Nf3 supports the d4 pawn and controls the e5 square. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Bf4 develops the bishop toward the center and fights for control of the b8 h2 diagonal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. Takes back. This reveals an attack on a knight. It is the last book move. This move puts the knight on a safer square. This threatens to kick a knight. It is good. There was only one good move in that position. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. This moves the knight to safety. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning material. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is an inaccuracy. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. This protects the attacked pawn. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is excellent. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. This misses an opportunity to take an open file with a rook. It is an inaccuracy. Recaptures. It is best. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. This misses an opportunity to defend a queen that was under attack. It is a mistake. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This ignores an opportunity to take an open file with a rook. This permits the opponent to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This misses an opportunity to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. This threatens to kick a knight. It is an inaccuracy. The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is good. This loses a pawn. 
This allows the opponent to fork pieces. It is an inaccuracy. This misses an opportunity to fork pieces. It is a miss. This threatens to reveal an attack on a rook. It is best. The rooks are coordinated and powerfully doubled on the file. This prevents the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a rook. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to kick a knight. It is an inaccuracy. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This kicks an opposing knight. It is excellent. This moves the knight to safety. It is best. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This is a fair move. It is good. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is excellent. A very strong play. It is excellent. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. This doubles the rooks onto a single file, which allows them to team up to create threats. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the start of the end game and black is equal. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This threatens to activate a rook by getting it to the 7th rank. It is excellent. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players.